I did not see this coming so soon. The classic boxer engine shape is known by virtually all riders wherever they may be. Two pistons opposing each other horizontally, sticking out from the engine. This look is also synonymous with BMW. Say boxer, think BMW. See boxer, think BMW. You would then think that when BMW would introduce an electric model, it would have nothing to do with the boxer shape. Since, you know, there are no pistons anymore. But this iconic shape seems to be so important to BMW that they decided to carry it over to the new electric motorcycle. Yes, that is what I said. Those were the words that came out of my mouth. BMW electric motorcycle. Do you want to see it? Let's take a look at this beauty. We knew this was their plan all along since they announced their roadmap for electrifying 25 models across the business by 2023. This includes both bikes and cars, but they are about two years ahead on announcing this bike. Let's go through all the details we know so far. Get your motorbike news in a pleasant way. Hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so you don't miss the next episode. Now, first of all, this is not a production model. Just like they recently revealed R18 chopper concept from which they will take the engine and put it into a lot of different platforms like a bobber, a tourer, etc. The same is probably going to happen with this electric concept as well. The Vision DC Roadster is made from carbon fiber and aluminium to keep weight to a minimum. The gas boxer engine and transmission have, have gone to a better place. A farm somewhere in the clouds with nice dogs and cats. And in their place has been put a new electric engine and by the looks of it a whole bunch of batteries. The protrusions that can be mistaken for a boxer engine are actually radiators with cooling fans for the battery which actually retract when the bike is parked. The cylinder shaped electric motor is positioned underneath the battery and is directly connected to a shaft drive, another component synonymous with BMW which I am more than glad that it has crossed over. So BMW really wanted to make this crossover to electric as painless as possible and the bit of familiarity they put in it certainly goes a long way. The whole bike is everything you would expect a BMW to be but reimagined for the electric age. The Vision bike shows how we are able to retain the identity and iconic appearance of BMW Motorrad in distinctive form while at the same time presenting an exciting new type of riding pleasure, stated the head of design at BMW Motorrad. Probably not in that accent. Further adding to this new out of space theme are the fluorescent strips added to the sides of the Metzler tires that can create designs while the bike is in motion. Paired together with the Vision DC Roadster, BMW also introduces Smart Gear. They have designed a riding suit with near invisible protection as well as light emitting elements to catch the eye of other road users, which obviously even has a magnetic backpack. Obviously. Absolutely no figures are mentioned in the press release. There is not even a single number printed there, so we know nothing about kilowatts, top speed acceleration or even price. What we do however know is that BMW is highly motivated to bring electric full-size motorcycles to showroom floors and this will probably happen a lot sooner than we all expect. Harley Davidson has its electric live wire just around the corner and considering the very unimpressive stats that that bike has, it shouldn't be too difficult for BMW to dominate the electric motorbike market. At the moment however, Zero is the company that is leading the pack when it comes to electric bikes. 
spikes, but distribution is the keyword here. Harley was the first legacy company to announce an electric model and no matter how much worse the live wire is compared to the zero models, as long as it's not disastrous, thanks to its widespread dealer range, Harley will beat zero when it comes to sales figures. The same goes for BMW. With their huge dealer network, any proper electric bike they will bring to market will most likely be a huge success. Good for them. So what do you think will be the first bike BMW will put this new electric system in? An R19? A GS? Hmm. Or something else? Let us know in the comments below. Let's see what crazy ideas we get. Well, that's the show, everyone. If you've enjoyed it, give it a big thumbs up. And if you think you've learned something, consider subscribing or becoming a Patreon to help us make more of these videos. Cheers, and I'll see you on the next one.